South of Novigrad, very close to estuary of Pontar, you can find the small city of Oxenfurt, famous for one of only two known higher educational institutions in the Witcher world, the Oxenfurt Academy. Originally built by the elves, a complex of majestic architectural structures houses the greatest minds ever to walk the northern kingdoms, now dominated by human scholars. The academy has several departments, known and mentioned in the books. Alchemy, natural history, poetry, medicine and herbalism, technical department and philosophy department. There is not really a lot of information about how you enter and study in that renowned college. Besides the names of the faculties, we do know who was the first rector of the academy. His name was Nicodemus the Boot. As well, we know some of the heroes who had the pleasure to teach in the halls of that prestigious school. Dandelion, Visogoth from Corvo, he nursed Siri at one point in the books, and for example, Shani, the beautiful and young medic from The Witcher, the game, first game. If you played, you might remember her. The currency used in The Witcher setting varies depending on the country. Still, it is known that some countries use a lot of currencies at the same time. Like in the medieval ages, only kings have the monopoly of coinage. So, in Sintra, before the kingdom was conquered by Nilfgaard, people use golden Sintran ducats. In Kovir, to buy and sell, you used mainly the Kovirian mark. In Verdun you pay with Verdanian ducats. And obviously Nilfgaard has a florin. But the most known currency is the Temerian Oren. Partially because of the games, Oren is used by Geralt as a playable character to pay his loans and bills. And partially because Temeria is a country placed in the middle of trading routes. Still, it is not the most stable cash in the Northern Kingdoms. That title belongs to the Novigrad crown, the most stable capital investment used by other countries as a foreign exchange reserve. Magic's most devious spells are curses. Unlike many spells designed or used to kill, a curse is a spell created to torment, bring misfortune or kill in a way where no one will actually suspect the caster. To add to the difficulty, every curse can be lifted, but a way to do it is a very complicated and dangerous task. Besides legendary curses, we know about three individuals cursed in the books, and at least one king touched by a curse in The Witcher 2 Assassins of Kings game. Nivellen, cursed by a priestess after a rape performed by him. His form has changed into a form of a monster. If you want to read more, I suggest The Grain of Truth short story. Flakesenet, a baron, he was cursed by a ex-lover and he was changed into a cormorant. And obviously there's Princess Adda, cursed as a child to change into a Striga, the most famous curse in the Witcher series. And obviously, as I mentioned before, in the game you have King Henselt, of Art Kareg, the ruler of Kedwin, cursed by Sabrina Glevisig during her death in a pyre. All these people have one thing in common. Geralt lifted the curses.